Here's the hard truth about losing body fat that most people need to hear. No diet or training advice will work until you're mentally ready to accept it, until you had that honest moment where enough is enough and you decide that something has to change for good. Until you do this, it's just gonna be one more diet that you stick with for a while and eventually drop off. And in this video, I wanna share with you one of the most important pieces of advice that will completely change your perspective and something that I believe every single person looking to lose body fat needs to know, so let's dive right into it. So most people, when they're looking to get in better shape, will try to pay more attention to their food choices, eat what they think is healthier, move more, be more active, or even may do a formal program, which could be a 60-day fat loss challenge or one of those summer shred diets, or even just go keto for 30 days. In general, when it comes to losing body fat, any approach will work as long as it restricts your calories and as long as you can stick with it. But the thing is, no matter how effective any of these approaches are, how much weight loss they generate initially, most people still struggle with changing their habits long-term. And here's why. There's a really big difference between temporarily changing what you do versus permanently changing who you are. And that's exactly what most people fail to do. If you took a random person from the street at 30% body fat and you somehow magically got them to 12% body fat overnight, how long do you think they can maintain that physique? Probably not very long. Why is that? Because they're still the same person with the same habits, the same beliefs, and the same core values as before. They haven't started hitting the like button, they haven't mastered the lifestyle, they haven't learned the skills to maintain 12% body fat, so they're simply going to bounce back up. A surface level change, such as doing a diet to drop 10, 15 pounds, look a little bit better on the beach, is fine if you don't care about what happens afterwards, but if you want more, if you want results that stick around, you have to start thinking about how do you make fitness a part of who you are, to permanently integrate it into your life, to make a commitment to yourself that you're gonna do the best you can to take care of your health no matter what. It's thinking of exercise and healthy nutrition as parts of your personal hygiene. If life gets busy or if you go on holidays, you don't stop brushing your teeth and taking showers. At least I hope you don't. And when it comes to losing body fat, the mechanics are pretty straightforward. You eat in a calorie deficit, you get enough protein, you're lifting weights, you're walking more and staying active, you're sleeping seven to eight hours, and you're hitting the like button. But the really hard part is consistency, patience, and making this a part of your normal routine. Because most people will do a program until they no longer can't. It's a binary decision. You can either do it or you cannot do it. And as soon as something comes up, which eventually will happen no matter what, because they're quote unquote on the program, it's easy just to go off the program and then the whole routine goes out the window and everything just falls apart. And this is a very flawed mindset to be in if you're looking for long-term results. Here's a personal example. I've been on this journey now close to 12 years, and some of you know this, but during these 12 years, I've been to 56 different countries. And a lot of those countries I've stayed for two, three months at a time. I've lived in more than 70 different apartments. My food choices have changed dozens of times due to travel. I've trained more than 100 different gyms, so my routine had to be consistently modified. If I was trying to commit to a quote-unquote program, there's no program on this planet that would have worked. There were literally hundreds of changes challenges and opportunities to give up. But the thought of giving up never even came up as an option. My mindset was consistency over perfection. And I was always thinking, what do I need to adapt in my routine to make this work? Because your training and nutrition will naturally evolve over time. Programs are supposed to change. But your deep level commitment to yourself is permanent. What are you doing? Powerlifting, bodybuilding, CrossFit, general strength training, fat loss, lean bulking, what are you doing? Body recomp, it doesn't matter. The commitment is there. And when you think about it like this, you don't just give up on your body when things get hard. You learn from your mistakes, you research better ways, you iterate, and that's how you get better over time. And look, changing your lifestyle is not gonna be easy. And it's gonna take a while until you create this new normal. And sadly, we live in a world now where eating fresh fruits, vegetables, lean protein, and whole foods is not normal. Where taking a walk is not normal in many places. Where lifting weights is just barely becoming normal, and we're still a very small community of people doing this. 
And if you do what's normal, you'll just end up overweight and unhealthy like most people. So we can't always rely on the environment to help us do this. And I'm a really big believer that real change happens from inside out. And the good thing is that at any moment, you can decide to commit to a healthier lifestyle, to live and act like that fit, lean version of yourself. And if you act like that fit, lean version of yourself, results will follow. And what's gonna help with that is making sure you hit that subscribe button below, enable notifications by hitting the bell icon, hit this for coaching if you wanna work with me on this journey or in the description below. Also leaving a very helpful video here for you at the end. So check out the video and I'm gonna see you right there.